disposal of plastic waste has emerged as an important environment challenge nowadays, where plastics make up as much as one-tenth of the solid waste stream. In developing countries, accumulation of floating waste such as plastic scraps, foam scraps or tree leaves in city canals causes water pollution and also block the drainage. Manually, cleaning the water surface is a tedious process, which is costly and inefficient. So, in order to stop the plastics and other wastes leading to oceans, an autonomous floating vehicle with surface waste collecting unit is used, which is far more efficient than manual process and much safer. The rivers act as a main medium to transport the plastic waste from land to the oceans. Conventional methods are used for collection of floating waste manually with the help of boat or trash skimmers. These methods are costly and time-consuming. Also, gasoline engines require refueling which might pollute the surrounding environment with leakage of oil and smoke. In order to avoid these problems, we have come up with a solution. And that's the river surface monitoring and cleaning robot. The proposed system consists of a surface waste collector unit which comprises conveyor belts and load distributor, a self-monitoring system, and finally a storage unit. The idea is to guide the floating waste near to the collector unit by using a barrier setup, placed such that the waste is not blocked or stuck with the barrier due to the water flow. To make it sustainable, the proposed system is automated with real-time monitoring, and live performance of the system can also be viewed, which helps to check the performance of the system and contamination level of the water remotely. An alert notification is sent from the system to the management regarding the need of maintenance. Eventually, this reduces the manual work and saves more time. The flight conveyor loads the waste onto the distributed conveyor. When the distributed conveyor is full, the bins are filled equally. The ultrasonic sensor is used to monitor the waste level in the bins. When the bins are full, an alert message is sent to the administrator via Wi-Fi module and the data is transferred to the cloud platform. The data will be visible to the administrator and public as per the administrator. Parallelly, a pH sensor is used to monitor the pH level of the river water, 